Alright, what's going on everybody? It is Mark here from obviouslytech.com and youtube.com slash techytutorials your number one place to go for Sony Vegas related stuff and tutorials and all that jazz um, even though, you know, there's a lot of other great places to go too but you know, if I say that it makes me sound better so, anyway, today I'm actually bringing you something different again from a tutorial I'm actually informing you about a new Vegas update but please just hang on for a second the reason I'm doing this, I wouldn't usually do this but the reason is that this update actually brings a lot to the table that you may not have noticed or you may have noticed and basically you should be updating I'm just gonna for one second outline why I just recorded this and it took eight minutes for me to explain why to download this <laughs> I thought it was ridiculous so here we go try and make it quick <clears throat> okay so I'm going to link the download link and this little patch notes thing in the description so you can see what it actually brings to the table and this is everything that's in this patch alone if you're on an older version of Vegas you can get all of these fixes also so basically the ones that stood out to me were the crashes with the titles and text generator the crash with third-party plugins that people have been experiencing there's a lot of GPU fixes as well if you're using GPU acceleration there was a lot of errors going on with that stuff that's now fixed also they have a lot of fixes here about rendering formats um, rendering with certain formats with certain audio settings and stuff like that so you can check out this list but even if you say okay well maybe only one of these things relates to me maybe I haven't noticed any crashes at the moment I still recommend updating if you don't know what version of Vegas you're on go into Vegas go to help go to about and you'll see the build up here at the top version 11 build 595 which is the latest and I'm on 64 bits when you go to your update basically the link is in the description you're going to check 32-bit or 64-bit whichever operating system you're on and just download that it's about 200 megabytes but don't be put off by the file size I recommend the download you don't need to put in any of your serials or anything like that you simply download the update you click install and it would automatically install without any fussel hassle whatever I was trying to say you just click uh, next I accept the terms install does all that you click finish and you're done so I really recommend updating to everyone out there who sees this because uh, you really should be running the latest version of Vegas Pro just to get the most out of your editing and to avoid those stupid errors that keep popping up. Anyway guys, hopefully I'll have another video on something, maybe tips or a tutorial soon with Vegas Pro 11 of course and um, unfortunately I'm still having a bit of trouble figuring out the whole upload to YouTube feature thing I think it might be based on connection speeds because some people can do it, some people can't I know if you can't and I told you I'd I'm sorting it out. I am still sorting it out, so stay in there, and um, I'll shoot you a message if uh, you message me. I will message you back. I remember the few people that did message me having the problem, so I'll message you back. Don't worry. Once I get it figured out, and once Sony reply back again, they told me this update would fix it. It did not. So um, I sent them another email, and we're gonna see what's going on. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching, and uh, make sure you check out the last tips video, which. Uh, helps you to increase your speed of rendering and uh, also kind of increase the overall performance of Vegas. Anyway guys, thanks very much for watching. It's been Mark here from obviouslytech.com and we'll see you next time. Peace.